Welcome to Hospitality School. Hello and welcome to the official YouTube channel of www.hospitalityschool.com. In our today's episode, you will learn everything you need to know about public areas in hotel. All hotels have entrance permission for both guest and general public. Hotels allocate their public areas according to the amount of investment and the number of amenities that they have projected for the guests and local public. These public areas require huge investment to make the outlook attractive and eye-catching. The size of public areas can differ according to nature of the property. For example, the large hotels have spacious and large public areas, including big lobbies, swimming pool, huge food and beverage outlet, as they have maximum numbers of room, large number of arrival and departure. Please pause the video and click on this subscriber button. Then log into your Gmail account and click again on the subscriber button. Scope of public areas in hotel. Both internal and external areas occupy the public area. Car parking areas are available for guests, visitors, and also open for the hotel staffs. In most hotels, there are different parking areas for hotel staffs and guests. Hotels in downtown location, or in remote areas, are required to provide accommodation facilities to their qualified employees. Some large hotels own a private beach or independent cottage spread over large acreages for the guests that broaden the space of public area. Whether it is car parking area or it is purchase department, every public area requires technical support with proper maintenance and cleaning particularly, the areas which occupy water, such as swimming pool, waterfalls demand great care, and proper cleaning. Sport areas, like tennis court, golf courses, which are provided for the guests, must be well organized and groomed. Rooftop, provides a panoramic view. Hotels set up their nightclub, cocktail lounges, in the rooftop. In some hotels, swimming pool is also located in the rooftop due to limited external space. In small hotels, resorts, motels, the dining room and the bar could be served as all-purpose dining service. Basement comprises of the maximum number of public areas of hotel. In the basement areas, there are several public areas could be established which are as follows. Car parking area. Housekeeping. Linen room. Uniform room. Human resources department. Purchasing department. Training room. Laundries. Staff cafeteria. Engineering plant house. Ground level. Where all general people are allowed to visit for any purpose. To generate revenue, ground level play a vital role, as it is open for general or local visit. In most hotels, the ground level own lower lobby area, including some revenue generating or producing areas, such as restaurants or specialty restaurants, upper car parking area, health club, indoor recreation centers, shopping mall. Some hotels also decorate their outside area, or the walkways with waterfalls, fountains and so on. Lobby level, has easy access, for both in-house guest, and local populace. The main entrance of the hotel, is generally located in the upper floor, where the main reception, and lobby are positioned. Lobby level is an important area of the hotel which comprises of several significant sections, with a view to provide service to the guests, and general public. Though the size of the lobby areas, determine its segment, but following are the commonly visible in hotels. Backside of front office, dining hall, banquet hall, telecommunication systems, coffee shop, security deposits, meeting room, Luggage room, 
Shopping Arcade includes beauty parlors, money exchange, drugstore, travel agency. Business floor generally runs for operational function of the hotel only. All executives offices are positioned at business floor. For example, general manager, sales and marketing, accounts, food and beverage and so on. Guest floors. There is hardly any public place in guest floors except business lounges in some hotels, especially for in-house guests staying in the executive floors. Generally, guest floors are located above the business floor. The numbers of floors are related to the number of guest rooms. For example, if a guest room number is 705, then it means the room is located on the seventh floor of the hotel. That's all for this episode but please don't go anywhere. You can read 200 plus hotel or restaurant management training tutorials and watch some exciting training videos. Have a look. Visit our website, hospitalityschool.com to download training manuals, PowerPoints, videos and read 200 plus hotel and restaurant management training tutorials. Attention, listen very carefully, to read this tutorial from website, click here. To watch food and beverage service training videos, click here. Again to watch housekeeping training videos, click here. And last but not least, to watch front office training videos, click here.